So today we are in the town of Eye, it's about five miles away from Dis. This is Rose Cottage in Langton Green, a charming two bedroom cottage full of lovely surprises. There's a garage to the side here, parking for probably four vehicles on the driveway. Partly walled garden. There's a pond here. Cottage sits to the, the rear of the of the plot. It's a good sized garden. Lots of spring bulbs. Nice sunny seating area here. It's now uh, 11 o'clock and the sun comes around and makes this a lovely sheltered sunny patio area to sit. And there's the cottage. There's some, um, I think these are pear trees on the border here. Apples. Got some honeysuckle. And then have a quick look round here where the path meanders around the side of the cottage. Take you through the, the Rose Arbor. Little woody area here. And you can come and play a game of chess if you choose. So as I said, lots of lovely spring bulbs coming up. And this is the front. Very, very pretty cottage. And very convenient for the town. Now this cottage has been refurbished to a very high standard. Lovely rose bushes along here, rose shrubs. The gardens are beautiful in the summer. And we're at back of the property again and about to go into the kitchen. As I said, it's, it's very bespoke. This kitchen has been made to fit solid oak worktops, butler sink. Um, here we have, um, there's a wine cooler here, but they're going to put a freezer back in that slot. There's a fridge hidden away in here. And the washing machine in there. Lovely old fashioned radiator. And up this end where the cooker is, You've got the bread oven, which they're using for storage of saucepans. And then here, a little microwave. So it's all very charming. Very, very sweet. And with lots of detail everywhere. And just at this end, while we're here, I'll take you through into the downstairs shower room. Nicely done. Again, period style radiator. Lovely doors. Everywhere you look, there's quality. And then we go into the sitting area. Little wood burner fitted to the fireplace. Lovely big fireplace that. It's very cozy but just but just so charming and inviting. And then through into the dining room. Another lovely room. You've got burner set into the fireplace there. It links nicely through to the sitting room. And the mirror 
reflects the light and makes the whole area seem lovely and bright, which it is. So this room is lit from three aspects. So this is the front door, a lovely door, beautifully made. That door goes back into the sitting room, but they don't use that door. And we'll go and have a look upstairs. So first of all, we'll go into this bedroom, which is now functioning as a dressing room. Put wardrobe to one wall. So it, it functions very well for a couple, perhaps uh, retirees or professionals that want a little bulk hole at, week, at weekends. Um, but it equally would function for maybe a young couple with a child. This is the main bedroom. And it has wardrobes built in. Now this room has a little surprise because behind this bookcase, I wonder if you can guess. Here's an ensuite bathroom. Again, period, period uh, fixtures complementing the age of the property. Good use of storage and a lovely radiator and toilet and a decorative uh, pedestal. Just very, very charming throughout. And I love these little features that are built into the house. Now, outside we saw the garage, which has a little workshop area to the back. Um, I haven't measured that yet, but that will be on the floor plan. Just to take a peek out the window so you can see. Get an idea of, of the, uh, the layout. Peek out over the front garden. Now, because we are just at the end of March, the garden will be coming into its own very shortly. The leaves are beginning to come out. That'll be colour. And in the summer, this garden is, is just stunning. So we recommend a viewing as soon as possible. So I think this is going to get snapped up. There we have it. That's Rose Cottage in Langton Green and I. If you'd like to arrange a viewing, please get in touch. The number will come up at the end of the video. And we look forward to hearing from you soon. Thank you for watching.